everyone, my name is Megan Fibbins and welcome back to another Tech Tip Tuesday. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing three of my favorite websites or tools to help you guys get better at coding. The first tool that I would recommend is called Daily Coding Problem, and I'll leave a link to it right here and also in the description box below, but essentially, this is something where you can sign up to get a new coding problem every day in your email. This is really great for long-term prep because you can just do a coding problem without even thinking about it. You don't have to look for them and you don't have to get exhausted about like constant coding grind. It'll probably just be like 10 or 15 minutes out of your day. So if you think that's right for you, go ahead and sign up for it down below. The second website that I'm going to recommend is called Coding Bat, and this is something that I relied on heavily when I was a beginner, and I think it's perfect for you guys if you're still looking to learn a little bit of Java or Python. And essentially, you can pick which language you want to do, and it has easier hacker rank style questions, and you can just write your code, run it through the test cases, and they do give example solutions in case you need them. So I would definitely check it out. It's sorted by categories, so you can do beginner, strings, arrays, and things like that. If you're interested in checking out Coding Bat, I'll leave a link down below. My third website that I would recommend is called Coding Game, and this one is great if you're looking for a fun way to get better at coding that isn't just grinding on algorithms. On Coding Game, you can create games and compete with others to get a little bit better at coding, and it's a lot of fun. It's really great for recruiting as well, because they have a whole section for recruiters where they can actually log in and look at all of the projects that people are working on. So, you never know, it could get you noticed. Like the others, if you're interested in checking it out, I'll leave a link in the description box below. That's all I have for today's Tech Tip Tuesday. If you have an idea or a question for a future Tech Tip Tuesday, leave it in the comments down below and I'll do my best to get to it. In the meantime, be sure to give this video a like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. As always, I hope you have a great week and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!